Hey there YouTube, CrystalOnyx180 here. Uh, today I don't have any openings for you, but I just thought that I would take this chance to take a moment and showcase some of my the rarer cards in my current Pokemon collection. So uh, as you can see right in front of you, there is a first edition opened don't know if you could see the sorry about the wobble first edition circle is right there team rocket booster box I believe that set is back from 1999 and uh, I got that for myself as a graduation present over the summer here um, I actually collected a full set from this box all of the ra hollow rares the secret rare commons, uncommons, you name it, I got them all in a binder, but um, I did send all of the hollows out to PSA, so I'm waiting for returns on those, but in the meantime, I filled the box with all of the extra cards that did not go directly into the binder or out to PSA, like uh, you can see, let's see, the camera focus. Yeah, there we go. First edition Dark Gyarados Rare. No. Dark Machamp. Dark Eradicate. First edition Mankey. And all the rest of the cards in the set like that. I think you get the idea. But, uh, got my little Mutant Rum right there. Same time, I also have a mint condition, Verizion Full Art. Um, I believe it's from the Noble Victory set, and uh, it is in perfect mint condition. I opened it out of the pack about a month ago, and it's it's been here sleeved ever since. So this card is... Very much so up for trade and sale. PM me if you're interested in that. And here I have my unlimited basic Clefairy Hollow. This was the very first Hollow that I ever pulled as a child. So I hold this one pretty dear to my heart, I guess. It's it's still in great condition. I might send this out to PSA eventually to get graded for uh, sentimental reasons and here I've still got my uh, ancient Mew Hollow it's hey this card's beautiful I mean I might get this graded as well do you guys still have this out there I I always thought this was one of the coolest cards And uh, now, here's the cool thing. Over the last two years, I have been collecting full hollow complete sets from some of the uh, first original Pokemon card sets, and uh, I'd like to share them with you guys. I do not have many from the base set. But here I have a base set, first edition Chansey. It's very nice. The uh, first edition Machamp. Um, I would like to get this in like another copy in better condition before I get it graded. It's it's not the best. Um, and a first edition base set Magneton. Yeah, I know, I still have to get the Charizard, Blastoise, Venusaur, all that. It'll be a while before I get the money for those. Um, I also have here from the Jungle set, which was the second set ever made, uh, first edition Cliff Fable Hollow. Electrode, Flareon, a Jolteon, 
Kangaskhan. Mr. Mime. I love the background on that card. A Nido Queen. Pidgeot. Not one of my favorite Pokemon, but one of my favorite hollows in the set, hands down. Beautiful card. A Pincer. First edition. Scyther. Snorlax. Vaporeon. Venomoth. Victory Bell. Vile Plume. And a Wigglytuff. So those are all the jungle hollows. Next we've got Fossil. We've got an Aerodactyl. Articuno. Ditto. Dragonite. Gengar. Haunter. Hitmonlee. Hypno. Kabutops. Lapras. I remember uh, back when the base set and first couple uh, Pokemon sets could be used in card games, Lapras was one of the staple cards for uh, Rain Dance deck. Uh, if you don't know what that is, go ahead and look it up on Google or something. It was a very powerful water deck that could be used back in the day. Magneton. Moltres. I'd like to get another one of them in better condition as well. Some of the gloss isn't there anymore. Muck. Raichu. And a Zapdos. Cool thing about this, uh, I believe all of the first edition Zapdos hollows from the fossil set was a misprint. As you look around uh, all the card, it's shiny and hollow foil, but zoom in a little, that corner right there is not. So I always thought that was kind of interesting. See, what was the next set after them? Well, that was Team Rocket, but those are away getting graded by PSA right now. Now we have Neo Genesis. This is the first set of uh, second gen Pokemon. We have an Ampharos, a Zumaril. Sorry about that. Bell Awesome. Fur Alligator. Very nice. Another Fur Alligator. Heracross. Jump Love. Kingdra. Lugia, probably my personal favorite here. It's a very hard card to find. Meganium. Uh, another Meganium. P. 
teach you. Skarmory. Slowking. Another interesting fact. Uh, because of its Pokemon power, it, back in the day, had the ability to stop an opponent from using a trainer card. So, uh, I believe that this was the very first Pokemon card to ever be banned in tournament play. We have a Steelix. Togetic. Typhlosion. Another Typhlosion. And finally, a Metal Energy. It's uh, one of my favorite sets right there. Oops, I dropped down first. And next came, oops, I did this out of order, I'm sorry, uh, Neogenesis should have came before these two, but oh well. Here is Gym Heroes. We have a Blaine's Moltres, Brock's Rhydon, it's a pretty sweet card right there. Erica's Clefable. Erica's Dragonair. All of these cards I'm showing here. I do plan on getting PSA graded eventually, but, well, that'll take a while as a part time job at minimum wage can't exactly get you too far in that department. Um, Erica's Vile Plume. Tenet Surge's Electabuzz. Tenant Surge's Firo. Tenant Surge's Magneton. Misty Cedra. Misty's Tentacruel. Rocket's Hitmonchan. Rocket's Moltres. Rocket Scyther. Sabrina's Gengar. Brock. I thought it was kind of interesting that they made uh, some of the gym leaders hollow cards in these sets. Erica. Lieutenant Surge. Big man himself. Misty, and finally, the Rocket's Trap. 